Hello, Daz community. This is Not From This World, and I want to welcome you to my tutorial series. Now, for today's challenge, I want to bring to your attention that we have a new update. And so when I opened up my Daz uh, the other day, I noticed that there's an update pending. Daz 4.22.019. And I would guard against opening this up right now because it appears that there are some bugs, as usual. Uh, you experienced DAS users know never to uh, download the newest version, but if you are new to DAS, you may not know that, and you may just be like, oh, yay, another uh, update. Let's, let's download it and get going. I wanted to show you something here. Uh, if we go to the DAZ website and we look under the forums, uh, I'm logged in here so I can view everything. I'm going to scroll down to the general technical help. And every time an update comes out, I always check out the technical help forum. And I'm reading through this and lo and behold, I come across this message that talks about crashes. So I clicked on it. And this person is saying that they are having trouble with the newest update. And as you read a little bit further into the forum, they are saying that the newest version, 0.19, is crashing with Mesh Grabber. And I use Mesh Grabber a lot, so I am very glad I haven't updated to this new version. I always wait and I'm going to wait until whatever is going on with Mesh Grabber is solved because I don't need to have scenes that I've used Mesh Grabber not work correctly. And so the best thing to do is just keep my DAZ Studio, the current. So now Milica is safe. I can use Mesh Grabber on her, change her hair, do whatever I need to do. And I'll just keep my eyes open. So when the newest update is fixed, then I'll go ahead and download it. Always a good idea to refrain from downloading the last big update. We had major problems with hair. Now it looks like Mesh Grabber is messed up. So just a word of warning, I'll keep you updated and I'll let you know when it seems to be safe to have Mesh Grabber open with the new version. But until then, just keep it simple and don't update. So I guess you could say I'm going to wash my hands, or in Milika's case, wash everything about this new update until further notice. All right, that's gonna about do it for Tuesday's challenge. Not really a challenge other than perhaps uh, you giving a comment, giving your advice on when we should update. I know a lot of you say, I've been working on, you know, DAZ 4.21 forever. There's validity to that, but I also think we need to update because some of the new features are super cool with DAZ 4.22. I really like them. The current 4.22 has no bugs now. This new version, though, seems to have some problems, so don't completely wash your idea about updating, but definitely be aware of what's going on. So I am waiting. Millic is waiting. Once we know that it's all clear, we're going to go ahead and update. But for now, we're going to wait. All right. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and give me a comment or two. Most of my viewers are not subscribed. You can really help me out. This little channel of mine, if you not only subscribe, but if you just check out my videos. I hope they're helpful. Let me know if you have some ideas on what you want to see. I'm always open to suggestions. And until next time, happy rendering and watch out for those updates.